Here is the solution of the question of the day. Ratio A to B is equal to 5 to A. Recall that this is a ratio. It means that it has an original value. Let us take the original value as multiplying it by a constant. So this thing has been reduced to this lowest term by a constant figure. Let's say the constant figure is K. So if I multiply 5 by K, I multiply 8 by the K, then we get the original value of A. Hence our A will be equal to 5K and our B will be equal to 8K. Similarly, for X ratio Y, we multiply by the same constant K, something that multiplied them to reduce it to this point, or divided each of these terms to reduce it to this point. So when we multiply it back with that term, we get our S is equal to 25 K, our Y is equal to 16 K. These are assumed to be the original values of A, B, S, and Y. Now, our A all over S means 5K all over 25K, which reduces to 1 over 5. Our B all over Y becomes 8K all over 16K, which becomes 1 all over 2. That is a half. Now, ratio AS to ratio BY equal to 1 over 5 ratio 1 over 2. Of course, in ratio we can clear the fraction by multiplying by the SCM of 5 and 2, which is 10. So 10 times 1 over 5 will give you 2, and 10 times 3 will give you 5. At the end of the day, ratio 2 to 5 is the solution to this problem. Option B in our option is the correct option.